Rick 83 here, back with another tutorial. So today we're going to be talking about dips, but we're not going to be talking about the upper body. We're actually going to be talking about the lower body. I'm going to show you both on high parallel bars where you're able to keep your legs straight and also on lower parallel bars where you're gonna have to bend your knees, especially if you're taller. First to the high parallel bars. The best part about the high ones is you're able to keep your legs completely straight, pointing straight down to the ground or slightly in front. You don't wanna arch your back and throw your legs behind you because that's gonna tense your lower back up and you don't wanna throw your legs in front of you because that's gonna tense your stomach up. So actually what you wanna do is make it a total upper body exercise and leave your lower body out of it completely. Don't do it! The most amount of tension is just to keep your legs straight and feet together. Now on lower parallel bars, you're gonna to have to bend your knees. So you wanna keep them just slightly let out at the bottom in front of you. And when you push back up, your knees stay in the exact same spot the entire dip. So they don't come forwards and backwards. You don't wanna stay at that 45 degree angle. Um, those things make it a little easier and also kind of put your lower back into play and tensing it up unnecessarily. You really want to keep this as a full upper body exercise. Thanks for watching. Rate it, leave a comment, ask a question, let me know what type of tutorial you'd like to see next, and I'll try to keep it coming. Thank you.